Dear ladies and gentlemen, dear colleagues, uh, good afternoon. Today, the, the 4th of March, 2022, uh, f uh, 2 o'clock Moscow time, 2 p.m. That's my watch. Um, let me start the, the work of the dissertation committee dedicated to the um, defense of the thesis of Sergei Sergei Sisoyev uh, seeking an academic degree of candidate of physical and mathematical sciences in the degree field 1.3.9 uh, plasma physics uh, on the topic the study of non-local plasma of glow discharge and its application for analysis uh, of the composition of gas mixtures by the plasma electronic spectroscopy method plus um, let me open this session uh, by the act of the academic secretary of St. Petersburg University Alexander Valentinovich Gnatov dated 25th of uh, November 2021 I Nikolai Alexandrovich Timofeev, Doctor of Physical, uh, Physics and Mathematics, Professor of, and Head of the Department of Optics of St. Petersburg University, was appointed Chairman of the Dissertation Committee. Uh, also, um, the same Act uh, specifies the membership of the Dissertation Committee. I'm going to go over the, all the names of the members of the Dissertation Committee. And um, uh, I will first uh, mention the name. Yuri Zinovievich Yonich, uh, Doctor of Physical and Mathematical Sciences, Professor of the Department of Optics uh, at St. Petersburg University. Can you see and hear us? Yes. Um, uh, Igor Cheslavich Mashek, Doctor of Physical and Mathematical Sciences, Professor and the Head of the Department of o o General Physics 1, St. Petersburg University. Can you see and hear us? Yes, uh, I can see and uh, hear you very well. Boris Akunovich Timurkayev, Doctor of Math Physical and Mathematical Sciences, Professor, Head of the Department of General Physics, of Kazan National Research Technical University, um, named after Tupolev uh, Kai. Can you hear and see us? Yes, I can see and, uh, and hear you. Okay. Mustafaev Alexander C. Tumerovic, uh, Doctor of Physical and Mathematical Science Professor and the Head of the Department of General and Technical Physics in Petersburg uh, M Mining University. Can you see and hear us? Yes, thank you. Davlat Kovatovich Solikhov, Doctor of Math uh, Physical and Mathematical Sciences Professor and Dean of the Physical of the Faculty of Physics of Tajik National University, Tajikistan. Can you, can you see and hear us? Yes, I can see and hear you. Yes. Let me introduce the candidate, uh, Sergei Sergei Sisoyev. Well, you cannot see him, but he's at the podium. Also uh, online with us is the academic uh, re uh, research advisor of the ca of the candidate. Uh, 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 Associate Professor of the Department of Optics at St. Petersburg University, Anna, Anatoly Anatolyevich Kudravtsov. I would like to inform you that uh, there is an audio-visual recording of this dissertation, of this, uh, dissertation committee um, session, and uh, it's broadcast online at St. Petersburg University. It's accompanied by, by a simultaneous translation, uh, interpretation between Russian and English. <laughs> On the page uh, dedicated to the uh, uh, the work of the station committee uh, of the uh, uh, St. Petersburg University website. So you can find uh, an email where you can send s uh, questions uh, and uh, these questions uh, should relate to now the discussion, the academic discussion, uh, the presentation, uh, uh, they will be relayed to me. Uh, they should be signed and uh, uh, the author should state uh, their affiliation as well. Uh, only questions that have to do with the academic discussion and the dissertation, the text and the assessment of this dissertation uh, will be read. Anonymous questions will not be read. In accordance with the procedure of awarding uh, academic degrees of candidate of sciences and uh, and the doctor of sciences in St. Petersburg University established by the St. Petersburg University. Uh, 
uh, bylaws, um, uh, a session of the station committee uh, can be deemed legitimate if not more, uh, not less than two thirds of the of the station committee. Uh, are present, uh, not fewer than four people. Our distinguished committee consists of six people. All six people are present. Uh, five members of uh, the distinguished committee uh, are in online mode with us. Um, so all the audiovisual contact with them is established. So the quorum is there. And uh, I would like to ask a uh, member of the uh, the office of uh, the station committee work uh, to um, start uh, the attendance list. And um, t I would like to continue now. Uh, well, the the work will not take uh, more than two hours, uh, approximately two hours. So let me go over the agenda. Uh, first uh, item is a short uh, overview by the uh, by the chairman uh, of the paperwork and uh, the person of the of the uh, the, con mm, the the data about the uh, the candidate. Um, uh, second, a short presentation of the candidates, not more than 15 minutes. Uh, questions uh, for the candidates, strictly on the presentation, two minutes per question. Answers of the candidates, not more than five minutes per all qu questions. Uh, then all the station committee members will take turns to present their reviews, uh, 10 minutes per speaker. Uh, the, the chairman will do the same. Uh, the candidate will answer questions. Uh, and uh, and then there will be an open floor discussion uh, that um, uh, that will involve anyone uh, who is uh, willing to speak, uh, but who has entered their name into the logbook for the, for that uh, two minutes per speaker. Uh, and then uh, the chairman will present questions that have arrived um, via email, if there are any, uh, and. Um, and then questions will be answered by the candidate, uh, and the uh, academic uh, uh, su supervisor will speak for three minutes about the candidate. Then members of the uh, committee can have a five-minute break to discuss the verdict um, behind closed doors. Then uh, before the vote, the vote, op open roll call vote, uh, and then uh, the decision is taken and the concluding statement of the candidate. Uh, and uh, to uh, to uh, go back to the uh, to go back to the uh, questions from from the audience and via the uh, email, uh, if the questions are longer than two minutes uh, to read, they will not be read. Uh, in terms in terms of the uh, behind the clause. Uh, um, uh, deliberation. Uh, the uh, the broadcast will be switched off if the, such a break is needed. Well, I would like to uh, uh, to remind you that that you have to follow uh, this tr uh, rule. If any of you uh, has to leave or switch off the broadcast, they have to warn me because this. Uh, I will uh, have to uh, to set up uh, a break. There was a uh, an incident um, uh, before in a previous uh, this uh, session, and uh, when one member of the station committee left uh, uh, the chair in front of the screen, and uh, then uh, they will they were not able to um, uh, take part in the uh, vote. Any questions as to the regulations? Everything is clear. No questions. And then, uh, now I would like to ask you to switch off your mobile phones, those who are offline. If there are any objections, then I will uh, start the first item. It's a short presentation of the chairman uh, of the paperwork presented by the 
uh, submitted by uh, the author of the dissertation, Sergei Sergei Sesoy from seeking an academic degree of Canada Physical Mathematics Sciences and Degree Field 1.3.9 Phys Plasma Physics, uh, wrote his uh, research. Uh, uh, thesis uh, uh, on the topic, uh, the study of uh, uh, the study of uh, non-local plasma of glow discharge and its application for the analysis of the composition of gas mixtures by the plasma entering spe spectroscopy method. Plus, uh, uh, he wrote uh, this uh, dissertation uh, in Saint Petersburg University. And uh, his uh, research uh, supervisor is um, uh, um, good drafts of Anatoly Anatolyevich, whom I presented already. Uh, this dissertation was ex accepted for defense on the 1st of November 2021. The, the number of publications is nine. Uh, all of them are in journals uh, indexed uh, by Web of Science and Scopus. Uh, all the paperwork uh, uh, are available from the member of the Office of uh, Academic Council, uh, Academic Committee work, um, and uh, they have copies of it. I would like to ask uh, every member of the dissertation committee, the members of the dissertation committee, do you have any general questions to the defendant, to the candidate, or do we need, do I need to go over every item of the papers, paperwork. No need to go over uh, the uh, list of the paperwork that was presented by the, uh, by the candidate. Sergei Sergeyevich, your work, your dear members of the station committee, they were everyone present. Uh, I present to your attention a dissertation for the degree of kind of physical mathematical sciences on the study on the topic of the study of no local plasma of glow discharge and its application to the analysis of the composition of gas mixtures by plasma electron spectroscopy. Um, the purpose of uh, this work is to study the no local glow discharge plasma as application to the analysis of the composition gas mixtures by the method of plasma electron spectroscopy to study the parameters of non local near near cath cathode plasma you have the negative glow of glow discharge in a tube at low and medium pressures obtain uh, the energy spectra of penny electrons based on uh, the spectra estimate the composition of the gas mixture as well as the concentration of, um, of uh, metastable helium atoms in, uh, in the discharge. Second, carry out probe uh, diagnostics uh, of discharge plasma parameters, plasma parameters with coaxial uh, mesh electrodes in a large volume vacuum chamber, for 30 centimeters in diameter, initiated by a variable and B constant voltage source in argon and helium. Three. Using a ring of probe, investigate the properties of uh, microplasma and discharge with a hollow cathode and a helium flow and at atmospheric pr pressure, and carry out uh, the experiments. Uh, study an impurity dust particles in no local plasma hom homogeneous positive column of a glow discharge to create an ambipolar dust trap. On the topic of the station, nine articles were published. The material included in the dissertation were reported at national and national conferences. Glow discharge is a common source of plasma. It's widely used in gas lasers. La light source plasma displays uh, uh, metal, metal cathode sp sputtering. Uh, high pressure and miniature gas analyzers are of great practical interest. On the one hand, such devices will take it, make it possible to carry out measurements outside the laboratory. On the other hand, high pressure will make it possible to abandon vacuum equipment and significantly reduce the cost of this class of devices. The main object of the study is uh, was to uh, the near cathode region of a glow discharge. The study was carried out by probe methods. The method of plasma electron spectroscopy with PLES, the main ideas of which were developed by the Department of Optics, uh, St. Petersburg University, makes it possible according to the measured language. Uh, 
uh, probe uh, uh, to the electron spectra E uh, of fast um, electrons produced as a result of reaction of pending ionization of impurity uh, atoms A by a measurable carrier atoms B um, to determine the constant of the corresponding process of the plasma of the positive column um, of low pressure and after glow conditions. In uh, in turn, uh, based on the PLAS method, a new method of identifying gases impurities uh, was developed when given the constant of the penny ionization process, the concentration of metastable atoms is possible to determine the concentration of impurities in plasma. Penny electrons, um, in order to register peaks corresponding to electrons, produced as the result of the reaction of penny ionization of an impurity, the following basic conditions must be met. The plasma must be non-local, i.e. the size of the plasma region should not exceed the electron energy or relaxation uh, length, where the, uh, in the region of elastic collision energies, the electron energy relaxa relaxation uh, length is the, uh, so one point, point two, uh, point 0.7. If the plasma non-locality condition is met, different groups of electrons have behaved differently. Uh, independent of each other, they do not have time to mix due to collisions moving towards the boundaries. Constantly, the electrons produced in the penny ionization section hit the walls, retaining their total energy, kinetic energy plus potential energy. The th temperature is thermal. <coughs> And um, in these conditions I met, there is no need to, to introduce a measuring electrode. Experiments to study near cathode regions of glow discharge at pressures up to 10 uh, thor uh, were carried out in a special cylindrical vacuum chamber 15 centimeters high and 20 centimeters diameter, uh, figure 5. Uh, preliminary evacuation uh, was carried out up to the pressures of the order of thor using a spiral pump. After evacuation, uh, the working gas was supplied to the chamber from cylinder through a reduced and fine adjustment needle valve. To, st uh, to register the probe, uh, current, uh, the uh, current voltage characteristic as well as their second derivatives, two commercial schemes were used in the dissertation work. Uh, the first is the measuring probe circuit um, of the multifunctional plasma probe, analyzer MFPA. Second is the imp impedance and lung wear, uh, probe system. Uh, also, in addition to the schemes described above, uh, uh, to, uh, to record the second derivatives of the probe IV uh, characteristics of the, by the harmonic method, we used a lock uh, and yeah, amplifier 5302 synchron synchronous uh, detector together with a uh, sawtooth voltage generator. Um, uh, a discharge tube with a radius of 5 mm was used uh, on fig in figure uh, two, 12, um, a show, uh, figure two, uh, 12A shows the current voltage characteristic of a discharge in helium with an admixture of air uh, as, and a pressure of 5 t tor uh, and increase uh, in the current uh, voltage characteristic of the discharge indicates an anomalous combustion regime when the discharge is most uh, stable. Uh, the results of the span studies. Um, the slide shows the second derivatives of probe I to uh, one to to five characteristics with respect to the applied voltage. The electron temperature was uh, 0.2 eV. Uh, the, its vo uh, vo value did not change with the with an increase in the discharge current. And uh, you can see that the, in the graph, uh, figure 313b, the peaks uh, are observed around 20 eV, uh, which corresponds to the electrons uh, arising in superelastic collisions 1.14 and 1.15. And um, they're associated with electrons formed in the direction of penny ionization of nitrogen and oxygen impurity molecules by metastable helium at atoms reactions. One 
of 0.16 to 1.18. Uh, the slide 13 uh, studies were carried out using the method of ratio radio engineering differentiation using a scheme developed by the Department of Optics of St. Petersburg University. The slide shows similar experimental results at, at uh, 10 tours. This slide shows the results of um, probe diagnostics of the negative glow of glow discharge in a mixture of helium and argon uh, at a pressure of uh, 7 tor with, uh, with an argon content of 14%. Figure 15A shows the current voltage characteristic of the discharge. And, f um, and uh, here uh, you have, uh, you can see from figure 16, uh, B the spectra of characteristic electrons are observed around 20 EV, uh, which uh, corresponds to electrons of s in superlight conditions. Um, then uh, here on this slide you can see that uh, that um, uh, interest has increased in experimental studies related to the propagation of electromagnetic waves in plasma under laboratory. Uh, conditions. Uh, this is due to attempts to eliminate communication attenuation when a spacecraft enters the Earth as Earth's atmosphere, as well as the development of technologies for creating plasma around an aircraft to absorb electromagnetic waves in a wide frequency uh, band in order to hide the aircraft from radar. Uh, the layout of the, the experimental setup and the program of the vacuum, vacuum table are shown in Figure 17. Uh, figure 18 schematically shows the sections of the electron uh, egg log system and an inter the internal view of the chamber and the photo of the discharge in helium with the probe located in the center. Um, uh, this um, uh, figure 18C was uh, showed the discharge in helium. Figure 20 shows the type of voltage applied to the electrodes as well as the probe potential for the investigated discharge with a frequency of um, of 20 kilohertz and uh, can be seen that the floating potential of the plasma changes with time repeating the shape of the power supply system and um, uh, to conduct a study with a signal of this form the circuit shown in figure 20 was used um, and this uh, slide uh, shows uh, there's also experiments in the atmospheric air uh, the, at the first stage, experiments were carried out in, out in atmospheric air at a pressure of 50 PA and a discharge of um, Pascal and a current amplitude of 5 amperes. Um, and, um, and figure 21 shows uh, the volt ampere uh, characteristic in the probe of various times of the period. This slide, figure 23, shows the volt ampere probe characteristic at different times over a period of a pressure of 50 to um, 100 pascals. And um, this uh, of slide, uh, uh, figure 25, uh, shows the volt ampere characteristic of high volume direct current discharge in helium, which ha has a growing shape characteristic of discharges with a ho hollow cathode. And then 20, figure 26 for the modes under study probe 1 to 5 characteristic were measured. The graph shows uh, the spatial distribution of the plasma concentration for various values of the discharge currents. As can be seen from the graphs, different concentration profiles along the radius of the discharge chamber are reserved for different discharge currents. And, uh, and the electron temperature was about uh, approximately 0.3 EV for each value of the discharge current. Um, and measurements show that the volume of T uh, along the radius of the discharge volume practically does not change, figure 29. Figure 30 shows the volt ampere characteristic of the probe located in the center of the discharge chamber for two discharge current values of 200 and um, 200 milliampere. And uh, figure 20, 30B um, shows uh, the high energy parts of the second derivatives of the CVC of the probe tables. Um, the tables um, from the diffusion equation for each group of fast characteristic 
electrons using the second directors of the probe CVCs, one can estimate the absolute val v uh, values of the concentrations of metastable helium atoms and impurity particles in the discharge volume. The concentration of the metastable helium atoms is of the same order as the plasma concentration. Um, then to carry out the probe diagnostics of the negative glow region of uh, DC glow, a discharge at higher pressure, two glass tubes would have soldered, soldered uh, cylindrical electrodes were, were used. Um, and um, this is um, the ring sensor was made to tungsten wire uh, 0.8 um, uh, millimeters in diameter. The block diagram of the experimental setup is shown in figure. 32. This, this slide shows the results of an experiment in helium at a pressure of 40 tors. Tor volt ampere characters of the probes as well as their first and second potential derivatives at different values of discharge currents. As you can, be, as you can see from figure 33, 33 um, uh, C, um, 33 uh, C, um, as the in the case of low pressures, the spectra of characteristic electrons observed at about 20 eV, uh, which corresponds to, the f to fast electrons produced as a result of superelastic collisions of metastable helium atoms in singlet and triplet states with glow electrons. This slide shows the results of. Um, uh, at 50 tours, um, uh, and this uh, the pre that was previous slide. This slide shows the experimental studies of a globe micro discharge with a halo, hollow cathode at uh, atmospheric pressure in a hem helium flow. Two three electrode discharge cells uh, were assembled, and the schematic diagram, which is shown in the figure 35. And um, in the first case, uh, nickel plates uh, 0 0.05 millimeter thick were used for the electrodes, cathode, and anode, as well as the measuring wall sensor. One, cat uh, one is cathode, two probe, uh, three anode. And in the second case, nickel plates 0.1 millimeter thick. The, uh, the scheme of the experiment setup is shown in figure 36. Helium from the cylinder was delivered through a tube to the hole of the s in the cell from the side of the cathode. These, uh, this slide presents the results of studying the parameters of a micro discharge in the helium flow at atmospheric pressure. And uh, this uh, this slide um, shows the plasma parameters for the discharge cells MHC1, MHC2. As you can see from table 9, the value is on the order of several tenths of an electron volt, uh, 0.2 to 0.4 eV. And uh, you can, for the entire range of discharge currents, the electron concentration increases with increasing discharge current from a value of 2 uh, M3. Thus, the region of the plasma uh, inside the micro discharge apparently is a negative glow. And um, the, in addition to gases, impurities, um, impurities in the form of solid dust particles can be present, present in the plasma volume, which should not, not only be detected in time, but also their movement should be controlled and, if necessary, captured and retained. Particular attention. Um, particular attention uh, is paid to the problem of dust control and, and thermal nuclear installations, which is formed to the erosion of the parts. Um, the, this slide uh, shows um, that um, s uh, some uh, shows the radial dependence uh, of the longitudinal uh, and ambipolar fields and PS in argon and. Uh, uh, for typical pressures and impairments with dusty plasma. It can be seen that the ambipolar field of the plasma periphery is so strong that the possibility of charged dust particles uh, hitting the walls is practically excluded. And thus, using um, a suitably uh, curved tube with its radius unchanged, it's possible to apply a simple and effective way to keep dust particles at a given re region of space. And uh, a special stand uh, was designed to carry out experiments. 
with dusty plasma and its main elements were a U-shaped glass gas chishash t tube with uh, molybdenum, uh, molybdenum uh, electrodes, uh, uh, the design of which is shown in figure 42. That was shown at figure 42. And this is uh, this. The, at first stage, the classical experiments were reproduced at a glow discharge with a stratified positive column uh, we, when the discharge tube was in a vertical position with the anode at the top and the cathode at the bottom. As a result of the mecha of mechanical vibration, dust particles were ejected from the container into the discharge region, uh, charged, in the plasma, charged in the plasma and uh, captured by a strong wind uh, field in the strata of the PS discharge figure 42. 45 A and B, and uh, in this um, on this slide, um, uh, you can see that um, uh, the um, the tube uh, smoothly turned to an angle with respect to the normal. Uh, the cl dust cloud continued to levita levitate in the stratum on a single system, and um, therefore. Uh, the conclusion investigations of the parameters of a non local negative glow plasma of a glow discharge in a cylindrical cylindrical um, tube and a helium with an admixture of atmospheric air and an argon at low and medium pressures were carried out. Second, uh, probe diagnosis of the discharge plasma parameters with a coaxial grid electrodes in a large volume uh, vacuum chamber, three c 30 centimeter diameters initiated by a, a alternating and B direct current. Uh, in argon and helium was carried out. Three, it's shown that the plasma in a large volume discharge associated to, by direct current is a negative glow with a low temperature, the main group of electrons, high plasma concentration. Number four, the energy spectra of electrons in the negative glow region of both the classical blow t discharge and the large volume discharge with the coaxial grid electrodes were recorded. Using a ring sensor, the properties of plasma is a micro, in a micro discharge with a hollow cathode and a helium flow atmosphere, atmospheric pressure was studied. The possibility of confining dust particles in a non local plasma uh, of a homog homogeneous uh, positive column uh, of a glow discharge with the help of a radial ambipolar field is shown. <coughs> the simplest dust trap has been implemented, which is a U shaped tube. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Sergei Sergeyevich. Questions? Any questions? Yes, one question, yeah. Sergei, you describe experiments of plasma of uh, with discharge with strata. Well, you you had uh, turned the the discharge without strata. Uh, how do you how did you make it? This discharge without uh, at higher pressure. So was there any uh, standing stratas? No, thank you. No, there weren't. So uh, guess again, uh, question. Yes, one question. Electrodes, and as I saw, were very thin, 0.1 millimeter. There, uh, there's a symmetry of uh, do uh, your electrodes uh, not burn out? Were there, were there any cases of burning of electrodes? No, the electrodes didn't burn. The flow of plasma coming out of micro uh, discharge was about 60 uh, Celsius, 60 uh, degrees Celsius. Thank you. Any other questions? One question. You, you know your experiment. There, there, there was a field of one order, of fields of one order. 
you uh, sh uh, what are the relation what is the relationship of these uh, fields and this is uh, order one and order two but they are of the same order how can you explain this Can you hear me, Sergei Sergeyevich? Well, in the, in the center of one order, and uh, then uh, going to the periphery, uh, they're increasing. But but it's accompanied by some physical mechanisms. How would you inter interpret this? Well, the the wall uh, is charged negatively, then the field increases. Davlet Kurlovich, are you happy? Yes. Any other questions, please? Sergei Sigesh, I have a question. And this is the it's in my review, but I have a different aspect. You used th three uh, schemes to. Uh, for zone characteristics, two professionals, professional and one original. Well, you never substantiated uh, the choice uh, of this or that uh, scheme. All these schemes uh, give uh, practical identical results. Uh, uh, the, these. Uh, the first schemes uh, are easy to experiment with, but but they're very uh, but the others are very expensive, and but they're very expensive. Well, my my academic advisor uh, got them. The, these uh, the, uh, pro scheme, multifunction plus pro things in and independence you you use micro charges you can find the absence of uh, gases components how how exact how accurate are your measurements in this case uh, for your how it, uh, with your devices what is the the verifiability was the to measure the concentration, the presence of atoms and uh, molecules of in, ga in gas? What, what is how, what the concentration measured in uh, in as a result? of the experiment of uh, high volume discharge nitrogen and um, the um, nitrogen and uh, uh, you can uh, you can actually assess uh, their admixture in plasma if you if you carry out the, you, if you lead to the construction of atoms in a molecule, well, the the uh, difference is one millionth of uh, uh, share of the ex mixture. Let's uh, so that's the that's wonderful accuracy. No devi no device can uh, achieve it. Sergey Sergeyevich. Maybe, maybe you will understand my question better in many experiments that you ma you did use you used methods of receiving t second derivative the the problem is uh, the uh, of sensitivity and accuracy the sensitivity and your reactions, 19.8 and uh, to 
to 20.6. So what's the accuracy of the or of the uh, of, of the using of the second derivative? As I understand, this is not really technical, but numerical. The the concentration and the composition are important here because the near it uh, there's a. Uh, uh, reaction of uh, ionization, penny ionization. So, how are accurate? What are the methods? So, the methods that you use uh, uh, give the accuracy not lower or higher than which what vol volumes? Well, and then uh, whatever method you use. You, uh, the method, uh, that no graphs uh, has um, the these the, the the data of the accuracy and the sensitivity. Well, the American differentiation. The signal was was accrued b through uh, multiple scanning to Im increase uh, accuracy. This is an emotional assessment, but this is not qualitative. Qual quantitative. The uh, we didn't change the uh, the hardware function. Uh, the um, Maybe I will help you. You use commercial schemes, commercial devices. Maybe in these in in the dis descriptions of these devices, maybe it was shown. So you. Uh, you didn't. Uh, you failed to uh, present that uh, these data, uh, this data, in your dissertation. Are you happy with the answer? I think we've had enough questions asked. I have uh, one more question. Maybe you will have uh, colleagues uh, some more questions. No, then I I will ask a question. You describe the 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 creation of um, an, a gas analyzer uh, did you study any potent uh, uh, pa 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 any patent issues uh, whether you want to patent it so what uh, this has this has a patent uh, uh, patented by uh, by the academic advisor um, during the, uh, the in the course of the work. Okay. Yes. Uh, no questions. Natalia Vladimir, have you, have we had any external reviews for the work? No. Then um, we um, turn to the. Uh, uh, the um, the reviews of the academic of the members of the academic committee. Uh, I uh, since uh, all of the reviews have been published on the website, maybe I suggest that you you concentrate only on the on the uh, critical remarks, etc. I don't have any separate uh, any 
uh, separate positions uh, that I can voice. Well, well, I will sort of go over my of, uh, assessment and, and a review of some comments. The, uh, the structure of the work is traditional in, uh, um, in the most part of the work and two chapters out of three, uh, uh, the author uh, discussed maths and the results of uh, probe di uh, plasma di diagnostics, uh, and uh, although the Longmuir uh, probe uh, is used for the diagnostics of plasma for many years, has been used, uh, in most cases uh, uh, it's used in conditions that are close to the classical um, uh, discharges um, in um, in uh, devices with characteristic uh, volume of uh, around one centimeter and with the pressure not more than um, a, a unit of uh, tor. So, but um, uh, but in this uh, work, uh, the da the range of these vo volumes uh, has has been expanded. Um, you have the interval of pressures uh, from approximately 0.1 tor to atmospheric uh, in discharge systems with characteristic uh, uh, size of uh, approximately 1.1 to 400 millimeters. Uh, therefore, this is the relevance of the work. Uh, well, uh, chapter one. Um, the, this uh, is based on the work that done at the Department of Optics uh, uh, and the team of uh, Kolokolov and uh, it, their modification and the, its modifications of the analysis um, of admixtures and gas good drafts of um, so and so the um, the main, the main row, uh, and the, this this why I would like to. Uh, this is very important, but uh, I would like to um, make a critical remark. Uh, is in the uh, in the statement in the positive column. Uh, there's uh, there exists uh, independent of the trial electrode uh, regions of the discharge uh, excitation and ionization um, that is carried out by local electric uh, field. This is not accurate enough. And uh, results uh, of the research, uh, it's proven that um, the the region of of uh, the um, in terms of um, <coughs> and um, so th well in terms of my remark uh, the critical remark is that uh, why it is not accurate is because uh, at uh, low pressure. Uh, there can be a non-local regime in the uh, positive column. Then chapter two uh, describes uh, devices, methods, and uh, findings of, uh, of probe diagnostics of plasma um, uh, in the discharge of a low and the low pressure discharge and. Uh, two uh, types of plasma sources um, have been uh, were studied: uh, a cathode uh, area of short uh, circuit uh, discharge in helium, and an admixture of helium, helium nitrogen at uh, the uh, pressure of um, five uh, to ten tor, and um, and the discharge in a large forty centimeter diameter chamber with coaxial. Uh, grid uh, electrodes um, in the uh, in in air and in argon uh, uh, with the pressure of 15 to 50 pascals, and 
and as a result of the research, it was proven that the the area of uh, a negative uh, glowing um, of the um, uh, of the uh, mel uh, glowing um, discharge. Uh, uh, it ca can um, have um, uh, a low electron temperature. So the um, my my uh, critical remark is that for the registration of probe characteristics, uh, you use three different devices, pages 42 and 43, but uh, but. Um, the um uh but you don't specify whether uh, which advantages uh, of one uh, one or the other has uh, to um, to achieve results and um in chapter 3 um uh, can, uh, to studies uh, zone uh, uh, probe diagnostics of plasma of uh, micro discharge, and this is um, this method. This uh, 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 this uh, probe uh, can uh, have great potential, but. Um, Well, when Nikolai Boris suggested this method, it was uh, applied to uh, study the constant uh, velocities. I think that this method uh, here was used, uh, you know, because uh, the academic advisor suggested. Uh, to study an adverse uh, uh, problem, so th this is uh, this is um, this makes uh, this um, uh, method uh, uh, not just theoretical but practical as well, and. Um, and so, therefore, uh, the, these uh, probe characteristics uh, prove to be apl applicable <coughs> in a PLES, and uh, with uh, the help of which you can assess the concentration of uh, uh, admixtures of, uh, as of nitrogen and uh, oxygen and met metastable helium atoms. Chapter three um, focuses on the um, uh, probe diagnosis of plasma of micro uh, charge uh, uh, in the context of uh, medium uh, <coughs> and uh, uh, 42 150 torr and atmospheric uh, pressures. Um, in the face case, characteristic uh, sizes of the uh, discharge uh, interval were approximately one meter, millimeter, and in the second, uh, around 0.1 millimeter. And um, the uh, discharge uh, was uh, uh, hit up, uh, lit up in uh, in helium flow. Uh, in which uh, uh, nitrogen and oxygen w uh, were also present. And uh, my question is, um, w when uh, the, int uh, the distance between cathode and, uh, and the probe, uh, the ring probe, uh, uh, is so small, um, can you uh, exclude the presence of uh, drave uh, uh, current uh, to the um, probe? And the second, uh, what do you mean by the term non-local equipotential plasma? Chapter four uh, is, is, uh, is one standing aloof uh, and um, uh, in relation to the main part of the dissertation because um, 
it doesn't have um, probe diagnostics of plasma. Nevertheless, it's very interesting and very relevant. Uh, you uh, show how you can localize a dust uh, cloud and um, and um, uh, uh, in a discharge of uh, low pressure uh, that uh, has a dispersed uh, dust component. This idea on which this method uh, is uh, based is not an obvious one. Uh, it's based on the uh, knowledge of properties and characteristics of the discharge uh, in a non-local regime. And the cor uh, the, cor uh, the question is uh, this, um, the author calls the tube, uh, which is used uh, in the work, a U-shaped uh, tube. Well, this this looks like it's a it's a pie-shaped tube, really. Um, a a U-shaped tube um, that is with uh, with an arc um, uh, connection um, would work too, but uh, it would work a, a little bit in a different way. It would um, select um, uh, particles um, uh, by their mass or or and or by its charge. Uh, therefore, uh, stents, um, uh, but uh, when I judge the whole work, um, um, it, uh, it uh, leaves a very positive impression. Uh, I already mentioned the relevance. Uh, uh, I just uh, want to, uh, to emphasize that uh, uh, a, a large uh, range of conditions uh, were was uh, used, um, uh, and the author uh, successfully applied um, uh, probe diagnostics of plasma uh, for uh, orders um, uh, on, in um, uh, gas uh, pressure, and uh, about the same in the char characteristic um, sizes of the of the charge interval. And this is in all and uh, the uh, the paper the work is very well written and uh, I would commend the author on uh, even uh, putting the the all the commas on the in the right places. The last thing I want to say uh, sure. Uh, yes, you have some time. I said uh, said that I like the introduction. Lots of um, references. Uh, you can give it to students to study. And um, when I compiled my review, I looked at some sources. I was shocked a little bit. Uh, can I show my screen? Can you see my screen? No, you can't. No, we can't. We can see you, but not your screen. Can you explain in words? The list of literature is this number of reference, the uh, the name of the article, in and in, in most cases uh, is the name of the journal and uh, the da date of publication. But there are no pages to the, or the. Uh, and sometimes uh, you, the name of the author, the name of the article, and then and then the the publisher's name, but there's no uh, name of the journal, and n nor uh, is there any uh, any uh, particular pages um, uh, where you can refer to. Well, the 
these references cannot be used, uh, unfortunately. This, but again, this uh, has to do with uh, the uh, with the uh, uh, editor. These are editorial comments, really, not um, never uh, not conceptual, and therefore I would like to say that um, I endorse the. I agree with uh, with all the comments. Thank you very much, Yuri Zinovich. Are you happy? Yes. Well, I'm more than happy. Sure. And the next um, member of the discussion committee, Igor Cheslavich Mashek, please. The colleagues, the candidate. It's hard to speak after um, Yuri Zinovich. Um, it was a very comprehensive review. I would agree with uh, the previous speaker, but uh, but I would just say that I enjoyed reading the work, the results, uh, and that very unusual for me. This is this is a very experimental work. And it demonstrates very serious uh, level uh, of an experimenter. Um, I will not talk about the relevance and the significance. Well, yeah, I understand the, the goals uh, that um, uh, are achieved uh, by this or that device. I. I agree uh, the, with yours knowledge that the Russian is uh, good here and the richness of uh, the informative informativeness of this work. But the chapters that uh, focus on non-local plasma and they um, are impressive. Well, I have um, some critical remarks. They have to do with accuracy. We already discussed it here. And uh, the method of accumulation is it improves the uh, the um, the sig the um, Compatibility with signal and uh, between singles, uh, single and uh, and other things, but uh, well, I would like I wouldn't uh, be uh, willing to go deep into the. Well, I agree agree that that um, chapter two is very professional. And I also agree that uh, chapter four is actually uh, stands um, sort of aside. And I uh, found some typos, of course. For example, I said uh, I uh, uh, spotted that for to uh, observe uh, dust uh, particles, uh, I um, uh, laser beam was uh, used uh, uh, with the capacity with the power of 300 watts this um, laser uh, un undoubtedly uh, would uh, uh, destroy the device nevertheless um, uh, the the thesis of Sergei Sergei Sisoyev um, at meets the requirements of the procedure of uh, awarding academic degrees in St. Petersburg University, and the candidate Sisoyev Sergei Sergeyevich deserves to be awarded the academic degree of candidate of physical mathematical sciences in uh, the degree field physics uh, 1.31F, plasma physics. S yes, please. Uh, uh, the laser was a 
three watt watt laser. Yes, well, three hundred milliwatts. Yes, that's okay. Uh, do you agree with the other? Yes, I agree with the other uh, remarks, uh, critical remarks. I happy agree, so sure. The next member of the station, but by Boris Akunovich Timurkayev. Dear Nikolai Assange, I uh, very happy. I was very happy to read this dissertation. Enjoyed it. I uh, saw uh, the as uh, I saw that uh, you study non-local plasma. It's very. I have been working f with plasma for 40 years and I uh, this dense plasma uh, well near the bottom area well there was an area of uh, glowing plasma and when plasma is dense the the distance between different areas uh, regions are is very short and then it's not possible to uh, assess concentration because the changes the in concentration it changes very quickly in uh, these regions and uh, so this the non locality uh, characterizes this cha these changes when when i saw that non locality also is uh, applied to uh, the wall areas and the this is um, near the wall areas the uh, uh, he well, it's good that he measures not only ampere characteristics but uh, the most valuable part is that not only the the author doesn't reduce uh, his work to the study of plasma but applies the findings to the gases uh, concentrations. This uh, practical side to the work, and uh, and uh, it's shown experimentally. This is this uh, gives it a, f a big future, and uh, this is. And the pre the previous uh, reviewers uh, said many things that I want to say, but and uh, there was a deep uh, understanding of the work, and these are specialists of a very high level. And I think that they uh, they um, actually described uh, what uh, Sergei Sergeyevich uh, uh, did. Um, and they even saw more uh, than uh, Sergei Sergeyevich actually sees in his work. The potential of of uh, applying uh, findings is very high. When and well, the, because. Uh, Sosoy uh, of Sergei Sergeyevich actually tackled uh, not only uh, the traditional areas but uh, near the wall areas, and this is uh, a breakthrough. And this, and um, I just to stress that uh, uh, the uh, articles published uh, by Sergei Sergeyevich are published by very high rating uh, journals. to 
they applied techniques of uh, of research um, big um, high appraisal as an experimental physicist he showed um, go, uh, go, good uh, uh, approach to experiments the the in terms of criticism uh, uh, there, there are some factors maybe that uh, are, are overlooked, though. The types of uh, discharges, and both classical and micro discharges, with atmospheric um, pressure discharges. And uh, enter electron uh, distance of one millimeter, and there's a flow plasma. This uh, a very interesting, uh, and uh, it presents a lot of uh, potential for study. As far as the scientific results. Uh, of international and Russian uh, significance level. This is a big step to an, in the understanding of plasma. I've studied the theory of explaining some er areas where con the concentration of uh, electrons and ionization do not correspond to, to the the field uh, value values and uh, and uh, it correspond to the areas the preceding areas where electron takes energy and uh, and the experimental data is uh, a achieved uh, uh, obtained here is very important well the the results of the dissertation uh, have been presented at conferences and uh, uh, but um, as I said uh, critical remarks um, still exist and uh, I will just uh, read uh, the first one is is the is, uh, the probe diagnosis of plasma and the interpretation of obtained results at uh, low uh, pressures uh, 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 the average pressures and the atmospheric pressures uh, must uh, be different uh, how would you account for the uh, specifics of uh, uh, probe uh, behavior at different pressure, uh, pressures uh, how does um, uh, non-locality of plasma affect uh, the results of the experiment? Second, uh, the this station um, has uh, some uh, provisions, some uh, conclusions that are declarative in nature, uh, and some of them uh, you should actually put together, unify under one uh, item. Uh, in uh, for for example, the um, uh, the author says that uh, an analysis of uh, the current literature has been carried out uh, that uh, that covers the the topic of the research uh, uh, and uh, it begs the question whether a critical analysis of literature has been carried out or um, and therefore uh, uh, whether it was done by other authors uh, and uh, what um, uh, must must uh, be done in this work and was work and also points two and three uh, there were st 
that a study was done and the point three uh, a probe uh, diagnostics was carried out. Uh, so you cannot understand from the statements uh, which, what new results uh, were obtained by the author. Nevertheless, uh, despite the uh, critical remarks, uh, 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 the um, thesis uh, complies with the key requirements of, of the procedure of awarding academic degrees. Sergei Sergeyevich, uh, please answer. I agree with the critical remarks. I would like to add the, that in experiments the, uh, with average and other uh, pressures, uh, we carried out uh, experiments in a diffusion mode. Uh, uh, Mr. Five Alexander C. Tumerovich, the members of the, the station committee, the Sergei Sergeyevich, I am in a dire position right now after uh, the other members have already said many things. After the, after I read the title of the session, I um, uh, thought of of uh, other members of the dis of um, of the, the university physics team because um i um they do a very thorough analysis of any station but i will just supply my i thoughts I think there are two main problems which pose uh, main challenges uh, in the creation, and there's the uh, uh, study of um, plasma electronic devices. The first one, they're, they're con uh, connected with the complexity and um, uh, and inadequate um, study of physical uh, foundations, uh, which uh, determine the, the behavior uh, sometimes paradoxical behavior of, of some of such uh, uh, self uh, coordinated and uh, unbalanced uh, environment as um, a low temperature plasma and the second group of uh, of uh, challenges uh, uh, has to do with the choice of diagnostics method traditionally uh, researchers uh, um, uh, uh, research of concrete, uh, uh, the, um, the efforts of concrete researchers uh, focused on the development of one of these uh, uh, directions. And uh, the relevance of the topic of the station uh, is uh, evident, uh, both from a fundamental and a basic, uh, from the basic and the applied perspectives. And um, the um, the, um, uh, the 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 very promising is the um, development of the PLES method uh, for the analysis of gases uh, um, carried out in this uh, research. Sergey Sergeyevich. Uh, uh, showed a uh, high qualification of experimental experimentalist. Even the uh, the commas, even uh, bad references, uh, don't diminish the main results. Uh, the experimental results are very high level. So the question uh, I asked uh, had to do with uh, the experimental results the accuracy and the verifiability of um, the results. And they they should be shown in an objective manner. Both qualification work, uh, the uh, Sergei Sergeyevich uh, demonstrated his uh, well-established researcher, but I have uh, two um, critical remarks. You probably saw them, but uh, I'll just read. Uh, from the experimental data, you can 
conclude that the uh, ring uh, discharges with the diameter of electrode uh, up to 350 millimeters, as chapter 2, uh, uh, can hardly be a, uh, a promising constructions uh, for the creation of uh, small size gas analyzer plus uh, uh, not only f uh, because of uh, large uh, sizes but also because of the violation of um, of the conditions of no locality of the pl of the plasma uh, formed uh, at least uh, in the axial uh, region of the discharge and uh, degradation of characteristic energies of electrons uh, plus uh, uh, of plus uh, away from the electrodes and the second is in this station the distillation ha doesn't have uh, the answer to this question whether the author uh, could observe characteristic spectres of electrons of plus plus electrons um, uh, at atmospheric pressure of helium and in the experimental experiments of uh, chapter 3 and why and the third is um, the uh, the material of chapter 4 um, uh, is re uh, redundant and uh, goes beyond the scope of the tasks and um, uh, but in the in the application for the analysis of the composition of gas uh, mixtures by the method of PLES. Nevertheless, uh, my uh, d conclusion is this: that uh, the dissertation complies completely with the the procedure awarding academic degrees at St. Petersburg University, and the candidate Sisovsky Sergei Sergeyevich deserves being awarded an academic degree of kind of physical mathematics sciences in the degree field, a 1.3.9 plasma physics um, clauses 9 and 11 of the procedure have not been violated. I would like to add here as well that um, very positive uh, impression uh, is that there are some experimental researchers but uh, not an experimental uh, uh, experimentalist of numerical calcul uh, modeling. Thank you very much. Alexander Smetomarovich, thank you very much. Sergei Sergeyevich, please answer. And the, unfortunately, we, I couldn't see the peaks. And uh, there's no um, when the uh, pro diagnosis of plasma interpretation result in that low pressures, medium pressures, and atmospheric pressure should differ significantly. In a non local plasma, the diffusion regime of electrons is realized. In experiments at low pressures, at medium pressures, the atmospheric pressure probes operate in the diffusion mode. In terms of the um, vacuum camera the uh, chamber and um the, there was um the um, the beam plasma has a, a low electric uh, I Alexander submit to marriage and I am very happy with the answers and I think um this method uh, is uh, very uh, promising, and uh, this is uh, the zone diag di the area diagnostics is not um, the only local method of uh, studying this uh, in out of the ordinary objects. Thank you very much. Davlat Kovakovich Solikov, please. Thank you very much, Nikolai Alexandrovich, the members of the, the station. We we already heard a lot about the, the station. This it stu studies the um, non-local plasma of um, 
glowing discharges of different geometry in the in the short uh, range of uh, conditions of uh, of forming plasma in terms of pressure from low pressures uh, towards and to atmospheric pressure well it uh, uh it um and therefore, uh, these methods uh, allow to achieve the the work uh, has very interesting results. The for so first uh, the um, research of the parameters of non-local plasma of a negative uh, glowing of uh, glowing discharge and cylindrical so tube and helium with the admixture of atmospheric. Um, air and argon at low and uh, medium pressures uh, with, uh, with the help of classical cylindrical uh, probe and um, a wall electrode. Well, uh, energetic spect uh, spectrums of electrons are registered in the um, region of um Vlad Kovatovich, uh, we can't hear you very well. Can you hear us? Some problems, and there's some problems with with the signal, uh, the communication. Dear colleagues, let's uh, take take a, a technical break number one, and trying to restore the connection. I I declare technical. Time, whatever it takes. Five minutes. Yes, let's do it in five minutes.
Devlet Kovatovich, can you hear me? There's some problems with the connection, with the um, communication. So we continue. Davlat uh. Konash, can you see us? Uh, we can see you, but can you hear me? And so the uh, I declare the first uh, break over. Davlat Kovatovich, please. some problems. I have a suggestion, colleagues. I, I will read the the review of Davlat Kovatovich. Mm, the first of all critical remarks and then um, the conclusion because the first commanding part uh, was said. Davlat Kovatovich, we cannot see her, him but uh, we cannot hear him. Davlat Kovatovich, can you hear us? I can hear you. Please uh, re continue. The author claims that the observed low electron temperature of the order of tenths of an AV indicates that the region under study is a negative glow. Similar conditions can be obtained using an electron gun whose oscillated electrons bombard the gas, but no one there calls the region of beam scattering a negative glow. How justified is the use of this terminology? The study, the study of two micro, micro discharges, MHC1 and MHC2, um, gives remarkably different temperatures and even more markedly different electron concentrations. The cells di differ only in the thickness of the electrodes and the probe. This leads to a slight difference in the length of the discharges. What is the reason for such a noticeable differences, difference in the plasma parameters? And uh, the and, and then uh, <coughs> the the dissertation of uh, Sisoyev Sergei Sergeyevich uh, meets the key requirements of uh, uh, of Saint Petersburg University uh, relating to the procedure awarding academic degrees. <laughs> Colleagues, so we have a problem. Devlet Kovatovich, we lost uh, you again. I think I can read that Davlat Kovatovich the the dissertation meets the key requirements um, of uh, of the procedure of awarding academic degrees in Petersburg State University, and the candidate Sisoy Sergei uh, Sergeyevich um, deserves. Uh, being awarded an academic degree of candidate of physical mathematics and sciences in the um, degree field 1.3.9 of plasma physics physics items uh, clauses 9 and 11 of the procedure have not been violated by the uh, the um, beam plasma um, the beam plasma has a low electron temperature as well as, uh, for example, the afterglow plasma of a pulse discharge. Uh, however, in this work, the main object of the study was a stationary glow discharge, and in which and it is the region of negative glow and has a low electron temperature, several tenths of an electron volt. In contrast, for example, to a positive column in which the electron temperature is several electrons. And uh, well, 
And then uh, the second answer is the difference between the plasma concentration and the electron temperature can be caused by the fact that the distance between the electrons increases and the measuring probe shifts somewhat uh, and falls into the transition region between the negative flow and the positive cold. Well, the Vlad Kvatovich is not here to say uh, uh, whether he is happy. Fortunately, we lost the Vlad Kvatovich. Oh, we can continue the work of our meeting because we have the quorum and um, still do do you agree that we continue uh, our work without the Vlad Kovatovich? No objections, no. Thank you. We continue. My review is uh, the last review. Well, practically uh, everything uh, th 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 uh, everything was said that I want to say. Yeah, I can uh, shorten my review. The work is um, dedicated to no local plasma, very um, uh, complex subject of work, and. Um, um, mo most f pioneer works uh, that dedicated uh, to this um, was in the 1980s uh, by Professor Golubovsky and um, and Professor Sentin. And uh, what uh, the this this task was very. Uh, um and a complex uh, and the theory um, proved to be uh, very difficult to carry out uh, and this uh, work uh, fills the gap of experimental data and therefore it's relevant i would like to stress that the work is well written the good language uh, the author understands uh, very well what he is writing about uh, easy read. Um, uh, critical remarks. Uh, some of them have already been uh, uh, already mentioned, and um, the, this uh, uh, this what I want to say is that three schemes were used for probe measurements to commercial multifunctional plasma probe analyzer and impen impedance along mirror probe system as well as the scheme was developed by the, uh, the Department of Water of St. Petersburg University together with the Yoffe uh, Physiotechnical Institute to the national to compare these schemes and point out their advantages and disadvantages. There's no estimate of the measurement error using these devices as indeed for all other measurement data. Uh, second, the multifunction probe analyzer. Uh, on pages 66 and 67, the diffusion equation and the solution are given. How this decision was made is not clear. Here's also uh, table 2.3, which is not described in the text of the station. And uh, for example, there are note that the, uh, the insufficiency uh, efficiently strict attitude to the description of notation, which is quite often encountered in the stations, makes it difficult to read the work. Um, for example, for equation 1.1, that the quantities used are not described. There's a question about writing the reaction relations, given the ratio of the radical radial electric field to the longitudinal one, were obtained at a qualitative uh, level from which it is impossible to include that which is more or less, uh, although the applicant's conclusion about the prevalence of the radial field of the latitude one is correct, but for the well, near wall region. Nevertheless, uh, these uh, critical remarks don't diminish the, the quality of the station. Um, the, uh, the results are being reported at different conferences, uh, and the village of the results uh, uh, is uh, obvious to uh, the dissertation of Sergei Sergeyevich uh, uh, meets the requirements of um, non-local plasma and um, the the candidate uh, 
deserves uh, a degree to be awarded the Vin and Plasma Felix uh, clauses one. Thank you very much, Sergei Sergeyevich. Questions? Well, uh, my answers are these. The circuit developed by the Department of uh, Optics in Pittsburgh University and the synchronous detector lock and amplifier 53 to allow rates in the second derivative of the probe current with respect to the applied voltage using the radical harmonic method. And uh, second, for each group of fast characters electrons produced as a result of reactions, the diffusion equation can be written. No, Davlat Kovatovich, uh, can I read the last points? Yes, Davlat Kovatovich, I did it for you because we couldn't uh, foresee what would ha happen. That's why I did it. Dear colleagues, at the beginning of our session, when um, one, someone uh, had to excuse, uh, leave uh, the screen, and uh, and then uh, uh, this person, this member, would lose the right to vote, and be not to put <coughs> at risk uh, the results of the. Uh, the results of the station of the uh, session. So, well, Davlat Kovatovich uh, said most of his review, read most of his review, and uh, only the resulting part was um, not read by Davlat Kovatovich. What do you think? Is it essential? Uh, was the was the his absence uh, so essential? I think uh, we should do this. But maybe uh, he will reiterate uh, what uh, he didn't, um, that he uh, he agrees with uh, the last statement. So uh, the conclusion of his review. Davlat Kovatovich, could you read the last part? The dissertation of Sisoyev. Uh, Sergei Sergeyevich on the topic of the study of uh, non-local plasma and glowing discharges and its application for the analysis of uh, gases, um, mixtures, uh, composition uh, by, by PLES method uh, complies uh, completely with the uh, complies with the key requirements um, of the procedure of awarding academic degrees at St. Petersburg University and the candidate Sergei Sergei Sosov deserves uh, being awarded uh, an academic degree of candidate of physical, physical mathematical sciences in the degree field 1.3.9, plasma physics, uh, uh, clauses 9 and 11 of the uh, procedure uh, were not violated by uh, the uh, candidate, chairman of the dissertation uh, uh, committee. Uh, of uh, Doctor of Physical Mathematical Sciences um, Department. The, that, well, is it okay that we continue working in the, no, in the normal regime? Natalia Vladimirovich is also prompting me. Sergei Sergeyevich, uh, uh, I uh, answered uh, uh, your critical Are you happy with his answers? Yes, I am happy with his answers. According to the regulation, I need to uh, to give the floor to those who are present in the and the uh, uh, the members of this. Is. So um, we have only Natalia Vladimir and my postgraduate student, 
Natalia Vladimirovna, have, you ha have we had any questions um, sent by email? No. Then uh, we continue. Anatoly Anatolyevich, uh, the floor is yours. Dear members of the, the dissertation committee, I was uh, I supervised his uh, master's degree work and um, uh, postgraduate work, and uh, when he joined, uh, and he uh, the, he worked uh, on on the experimental work with uh, another postdoc and Sergei Sergeyevich um, uh, uh, completed all the work uh, on the experiment that uh, uh, that he was charged with that's why he um, completed uh, his qualification work on the dissertation published um, uh, the necessary number of uh, articles in international journals, and um, now he is uh, he is uh, a well-established uh, uh, physics scholar and uh, researcher, and um, ready to continue his work. That's why he deserves um, uh, the sort academic de degree. Thank you very much. Do we have any questions from from members uh, of the decision committee? No. And then I will just like to say a couple of words. The work of Sergei Sergeyevich um, was uh, I witnessed his work. Uh, he was a uh, postgraduate of um, a colleague. And I, I saw w the work being carried out. The main advantage uh, is the, uh, of the work is the experimental. It's experimental nature. Uh, it's hard to carry out such work uh, uh, in the current conditions. Uh, but Anatoly Anatolyevich and Sergei Sergeyevich uh, managed to complete this work, and it's very valuable. And the findings are very valuable. The second one is um, sometimes positive and uh, somewhat negative. Uh, he, Sergei Sergeyevich was very independent. Um, he, I thought that uh, he solved some problems without uh, consulting Anatoly Anatolyevich, but, um, but when he uh, presented his work at the department, uh, the, it was raw material. and. Uh, and uh, it turned out that um, that uh, the report had not been even discussed with Anatoly Anatolyevich, uh, uh, but then he he corrected his uh, his uh, presentation and um, and uh, it was then uh, re-reported uh, and um, to to critical acclaim of the department and and I think that this work. Um, is at the level of a candidate of sciences. I will, I will say it uh, formally when we vote. Any, anything to add from members of the station committee? Nikolai Alexandrovich, just a few, just a couple of words. I. I uh, work uh, uh, in other universities. I returned from the Netherlands uh, recently. One of the uh, the worst uh, things is numerical uh, modeling without any possibility to, to verify the results. And. I would like to say, uh, express my gratitude on the on behalf of even um, the whole committee uh, to 
uh, to Anatoly Alexandrovich Kudravtsov um, for to, to for carrying out uh, the the work of uh, uh, Khmadudin Siranovich uh, and um, and uh, this level uh, is uh, upheld. Thank you, Sansa Tomerovich. Then uh, we continue to the um, vote. First one, we have two questions, two, two options. Uh, one is to meet behind closed doors to deliberate the verdict. And, and uh, Usually, this uh, this uh, option is chosen when there is disagreement, and the second uh, option is we don't have, uh, we don't take uh, this break, and then we'll just uh, ask each member of the uh, committee to express uh, their uh, vote. Second vote, yes. Open vote, yes. Thank you very much. Then I put to the vote the resolution to award Sergei Sergei Sisov an academic degree of candidate physical mathematical sciences in plasma phys physics for open roll vote. And uh, I would like to stress that when you vote in favor, Every member of the station committee agrees that uh, clause 11 of the um, procedure is not violated. I would like to, um, if the procedure is not violated, I uh, would like to quote that clause 11, uh, the candidate must uh, refer to the authors or the sources of of um, uh, cited materials uh, and uh, results, uh, and uh, w when the station uses the results of uh, research works um, um, that uh, that is carried out by the uh, candidate himself or in co-authorship, uh, the candidate uh, must um, uh, specify this circumstance in the dissertation. Well, and uh, plagiarism uh, uh, detection is always carried out, and this has been carried out and with this dissertation, too. And therefore, I would like to give the floor to, uh, uh, to our members um, and um, ask each uh, member of the dissertation uh, how they, uh, to, to express their vote. I will call out a name, and uh, the person, the member of the station committee, will say their opinion. Yuri Zinovich Yonich, your opinion. I am in favor of awarding the degree. Igor Chislavich Mashik. Of course, I am in favor of awarding the third degree to the candidate. Boris Akunovich Timirka. I am in favor of uh, awarding the the uh, the kind of science degree in, in physics and mathematics and physics. Um, Alexander Kseed Merovich Mustafaev, I am in favor of awarding the the uh, uh, the academic degree. Um, uh, Anika Alexander, I um, I vote. Davlat uh, Kovatovich. Uh, I uh, I'm in favor. And Nikolai Alexander Timofeev, I vote in favor of awarding the degree. Therefore, I would like to announce that our six uh, members of the station committee that are present, that are uh, that compose the academic committee, six people voted in favor. Nobody voted against and nobody abstained. Therefore, the decision 
to award uh, Sergei Sergei Sisov the, the academic degree of physical mathematical sciences in plasma physics uh, has been taken. I would like to thank St. Petersburg University and members of the station committee, the chairman and all present, and my academic advisor. Thank you. Before I, for, I thank uh, the members of the station committee for the. I would like to congratulate you on the successful defense. And we hope that you will stay in physics and continue your uh, activities in this area. This, this work is very interesting. Continue your work, please. The session is closed. Thank you for the participation. I would like to thank personally Davlat Kovatovich, who is um, our international member of the committee from the from the far land of the uh, Tajikistan and we're very happy that you took part in our uh, committee work and I hope that uh, in the future you will take part an uh, in, in active part in other uh, committee sessions in other committees and I hope to keep up our cooperation Thank you for the warm words. The, the Department of Theoretical Physics in our university, uh, we study the, the diff, uh, diffuse, diffused uh, electromagnetic waves. We have postgraduates here who uh, study gases, and uh, our postgraduates um, is defending uh, um, the ninth, on the 19th of May uh, and defending his dissertation in the Moscow State University. And today's dissertation is uh, 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 makes a makes a contribution in gas discharges, uh, the study of gas discharges, and uh, and. And uh, this uh, contribution, and uh, not only uh, to that would help our uh, young researchers, but but anyone working in this area. Nikolai Alexandrovich, I would like to thank you. Please, um, if you uh, have a chance to visit us. Uh, our university would love to to welch, welcome you in our to our university. Thank you very much. Thank you very much uh, for the invitation. I've been uh, to your university several times, uh, and uh, I enjoyed it, uh, and it was very useful. I would like to thank all other members of the station committee for the participation and for the help and for this fruit, fruitful work. Thank you very much. Uh